Are you among the numerous individuals who are curious in Tesla stock's potential future value? Given the exponential rise in Tesla stock prices over the last 10 years, it is understandable that investors are curious about what will happen next. But one very famous investor, the one and only Oracle of Omaha, Warren Buffett has chosen not to join the ranks of eager Tesla backers. Elon frequently discusses this. When Musk and Munger had lunch back in 2008, Buffett's right-hand man, Charlie Munger, and Buffett might have entered the Tesla game very, very early. Munger, however, lost out on a 50x gain when he turned down his invitation to invest. Have Buffett and Munger reconciled enough to declare their readiness to project the stock price positively through 2024? In this video, we'll examine Munger and Buffett's stock projection as well as the long-term growth potential of Tesla, but hit that subscribe and like button before we head there. Many individuals are interested in knowing how much Tesla stock will be worth in two years. More and more people these days are optimistic that owning Tesla stock could end up being a great asset in the near future. Check out today's episode if you want to see how much Munger and Buffett think Tesla shares will be worth in 2024. It's undeniable that Tesla stock is rising despite impending obstacles. The EV company shares have soared over 20,000% since going public in 2010, handily surpassing the market overall, often shattering Wall Street projections and making early investors billionaires. Saying that the growth rate is unusual would be a grave understatement. Elon continued to explain in a series of tweets that Berkshire Hathaway would have made a sizable profit today if it had seized the opportunity to invest in Tesla in 2008 when the firm was only valued at $200 million. The market value of Tesla is currently greater than $600 billion in October 2021 and March of last year. It even crossed the $1 trillion threshold. When I had lunch with Munger in late 2008, at a valuation of about $200 million, he could have invested in Tesla, Musk said. Musk has already brought up Charlie Munger, the vice chairman of Berkshire Hathaway and Buffett's right-hand man in relation to what the businessman believes to be a lost chance for the holding firm. Musk revealed last year that Munger had foreseen Tesla's demise as early as 2009. The tech tycoon stated on February 16th, 2022, I was at a lunch with Munger in 2009, where he told the entire table all the reasons why Tesla would fail. It made me quite sad, but I told him that I agreed with all those reasons and that we would probably fail, but it was worth attempting nonetheless. On February 4th, 2020, a $1,000 investment made in Tesla during the IPO in 2010 would have grown to about $36,000. To put this into perspective, CNBC projects that on March 25th, 2022, a $1,000 investment made in the SP500 index in March 2012 would be worth $1,487.22. While the SP500 and the price of gold also experienced big increases during the same time period, this notable gain is not bad. Analysts, however, believe Tesla will see higher long-term growth. Conversely, Based on the alternative pattern, by June 2022, Tesla shares valued at $6,940 will have earned about $7,540 in profits. This gain is noteworthy, even though many predictions indicate that the price of Tesla stock would keep declining. This may be largely attributed to Musk's distinctive leadership style and the fact that his electric car company leads the competition in R&D and product development by a wide margin. Elon Musk has become the most prominent CEO in the world in recent months, and his appeal grows daily. Having nearly 130 million Twitter followers, he receives millions of views and media coverage for every tweet and message he posts. His ambition to transform present and future transportation means have allowed Tesla, the electric vehicle manufacturer he co-founded and serves as CEO of, to achieve an unprecedented stock market rise for an automotive company. With a market valuation of $622 billion as of right now, Tesla is valued more than Toyota Motor, which was the biggest automaker globally in terms of sales last year by over $400 billion. Although the market value of the Japanese automaker is currently $188 billion, Tesla's price is justified by Musk's ability to inspire significant trust in investors since the company is now valued similarly to its rivals. As an alternative, the business is thought of more as a tech consortium than a conventional automaker. In a sense, the millionaire CEO became the face and voice of Tesla, building the company's authority and reputation all by himself. The investors are expected to keep driving the company's stock to all-time highs as long as he is in charge. While Elon Musk is regarded highly by many investors, one prominent exception is the renowned investor Warren Buffett, who feels that one should completely understand a company's business before making an investment in it. Nonetheless, it is well known that Buffett, dubbed the Oracle of Omaha, opted to invest in Bide, Tesla's primary rival in China. Although Bide outsold Tesla in clean car sales last year, Bide also also offers hybrid cars, which combine electric and petrol motors. Nevertheless, when all electric cars are taken into account, Tesla continues to lead the world market. Berkshire Hathaway, Buffett's parent firm, spent $232 million to buy 225 million shares of Bide in 2008. Since then, the investment has increased dramatically, as seen by the years-long rise in Bide's stock price. 
the billionaire has been cutting back on his ownership of Bide for the last few months. According to a regulatory filing earlier this month, Berkshire Hathaway has sold about 95 million of the 225 million shares it. Initially owned in the company, it has also so sold an additional 4.235 million shares valued at around $140 million with 130.3 million shares or almost 12% of the Chinese firm. The holding company is still among the biggest buyed stockholders despite the decrease. In light of the fact that Berkshire Hathaway finished 2022 with a sizable cash reserve of $128 billion, up from almost $109 billion in the previous quarter, a Twitter user asked which firm Warren Buffett could invest in. Musk replied right away, suggesting that the holding company think about making an investment in Tesla. The millionaire joked that the name begins with a T. Currently, Tesla is developing a number of much-awaited new projects that should raise earnings and revenue for the business and consequently boost stock price. A few examples are the Starlink project, Tesla's FSD Optimus robot with artificial intelligence, and the Cybertruck. It will be interesting to observe how Tesla performs in terms of growth and profitability when its AI initiative has been successfully implemented. Tesla's stock price is expected to rise sharply if the business continues to lead the artificial intelligence space, as they did with electric vehicle systems EVs. The value of Tesla stock was far less than $100 prior to the market bubble. However, in the intervening period, its value has grown by a factor of 2, 3, and even 10. In less than three years, investors who own 10 shares or more of Tesla stock could see a 100% return on their investment. Tesla shares will be worth $4,000 by 2026, according to a new valuation model that Kathy Wood's ARK Invest just unveiled. This is a rise over the company's initial 2025 estimate of $3,000 per share. Pre-split figures are these. New information and developments, such as the widespread use of the term fully autonomous driving caused them to reevaluate their position. After making changes to its model, ARK Invest now expects a higher level of demand for autonomous ride hails at higher price points than it projected in its first market forecast. This is because after learning more about how customers value their time, the business is now more certain that Tesla will figure out a way to achieve completely autonomous driving. Additionally, they have advanced their forecast to 2026, a year earlier than previously anticipated. In the end, Munger has stated that he still has misgivings about Tesla despite the anticipated enormous growth. Munger recently stated unequivocally that he thinks Bide is better than Tesla. Munger answered clearly when asked if he prefers Bide to Tesla. He emphasized that although Tesla twice reduced the price of its vehicles in China last year, Bide was able to boost its prices. Munger said that considering that Bide occupies a sizable chunk of Manhattan Island's area for production, the company's supremacy in China when contrasted to Tesla is almost ludicrous. We're going to have to part ways now, but if you liked it, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you in the next video. Music. In the end, Munger has stated that he still has misgivings about Tesla despite the anticipated enormous growth. Munger recently stated unequivocally that he thinks Bide is better than Tesla. Munger answered clearly when asked if he prefers Bide to Tesla. He emphasized that although Tesla twice reduced the price of its vehicles in China last year, Bide was able to boost its prices. Munger said that considering that Bide occupies a sizable chunk of Manhattan Island's area for production, the company's supremacy in China, when contrasted to Tesla, is almost ludicrous. We're going to have to part ways now, but if you liked it, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you in the next video. Music.